what is going on guys hope you guys are doing well today i'm going to be talking about sui network um this is an up and coming layer one that has a little bit of uh challenging factors against solana ethereum all these other networks that are out there i believe sui network is really not on the scale of things right now i think that a lot of people haven't been talking about it but here i am today and we're going to chat about sui sui network that's s-u-i all right, so over the, over the past three months, SUI Network has seen some significant growth in decentralized finance activity. SUI TVL has essentially grown over 341% in these last three months, okay? Volume breaking 220%. And this is a brand new project that I believe will have some success in the crypto space. The SUI blockchain stands as a distinctive entity within the Web3 ecosystem. They offer a fresh, and perspect they offer a fresh new perspective uh, in the crypto world right of decentralized technology so in its journey in the cryptocurrency sphere sui has been marked by remarkable achievements notably in the realms of like fundraising and valuation growth um we'll get more into that in this video let me talk about this channel real quick so guys i'm essentially <clears throat> when i created this channel i did it to help people and I really want to get out there and reach as many people as I can and teach as many people as I can not to only focus on Bitcoin or Ethereum or Jasmine coin or these projects that I'm adamant about. But I am starting to explore different cryptocurrencies that may have huge potential. So this is why I'm sharing it with you. I'm sharing it because I'm essentially passionate and eager to share my knowledge and expertise by simplifying fundamentals and investing strategies to empower people. My mission is to break down the complexities of crypto and reword it into easy and understanding concepts like explaining the wording and technicalities. Essentially, my aim is to guide people towards success by teaching them the basics, like how to securely store, door, uh, store digital assets, how to conduct thorough research on coins, the importance of strategies like dollar cost averaging, risk management, etc. My goal is to essentially make cryptocurrency investing accessible and approachable, equipping individuals with the knowledge and confidence to navigate this exciting financial frontier and protect, potentially achieve your investment goals. My goals are ultimately your investment goals. My strategies are going to be your strategies. This is why I created Run My Crypto. So please, guys, make sure you hit that like button. Make sure you guys subscribe. Hit that bell notification so you can stay up to date on all the videos that I put out, introducing new cryptocurrencies that you may not have heard of and going over cryptocurrencies that you like. So please drop in the comments on any video you watch, what cryptocurrencies you like, and I'll go ahead and take my time and jump into them and deep, deep, uh, deep dive, whatever you guys want. Any questions you guys have, if I don't have the answer right away, I'll get it for you, all right? So welcome to Run My Crypto. Let's get into this video. Sui, here we go. First off, guys, I apologize if the video, like if my voice sounds off, um, I had an injury to my leg uh, just recent, not an injury, but something that came up in my leg where it's been tough to walk. I've been taking a lot of medication and stuff. So bear with me, guys. I'm trying to do this while being uh, in pain. <laughs> so just bear with me, guys, if I, I seem a little off in my voice and stuff. So but anyways, for SUI, we're going to talk about the, some of the real world use cases for the SUI blockchain. So. Let's go into it. So the SUI blockchain is making a mark um, in the practical realm of Web3 technology with a diverse array of applications. So we'll start to we'll look at the first uh, narrative that they're pushing in real world, uh, real world use cases. Um, so gaming projects. So SUI essentially has like a hub for gaming innovation, um, hosting like nine gaming projects, I believe it is, including uh, High Fantasy Adventure, uh, Abyss World and the active lifestyle encouragement of run legends um so these are like their most popular games so far um that you know it's pretty pretty neat too is like i had an opportunity to jump on their their test net so before sui actually launched their main net um they gave access to uh their test net and it was cool you got to go in there create nfts you could actually uh buy and purchase and sell nfts um i got into a couple of their games it was pretty cool um i think that uh they're they're essentially just on the right track and then the way that they're doing things is very like every everything that i went into was super fast like swapping sui tokens um buying sui tokens trading them for ethereum solana and stuff like that 
So it's pretty interesting. So they're DeFi protocols. Um, so in decentralized finance, I think Sui shines because they provide a, a secure foundation for protocols like Turbo Finance, um, Omni BTC, uh, Cetus, Aftermath Finance, and Cetus Protocol. Um, also in their decentralized social interaction, so just like ICP, Internet Computer, and Ethereum, and everybody else, uh, they have a decentralized social interaction with uh, Sui basically empowers social networks, resistance to centralized censorship. Um, they have poly media chat, which is pretty awesome. Uh, basically fosters community uh, through uh, Suya, I believe it is, uh, connecting user based um, shared NFTs. Um, so it's kind of works in in, co in coincides with like NFTs and like a, it's another platform similar to Discover on ICP, uh, which is pretty pretty awesome for for sui um their nft projects i got i did get a chance to play around in their nft space so i actually went in and created it created an nft um on their test net which was super awesome um i think that there's a lot of uh potential in that the nft space as far as uh, sui goes um they have uh i think it was called uh cosmocadia um there's cosmocadia heaven's compass um studio mirai and then aftermath finance run legend suya um there's a bunch of different uh nft spaces there's another one that oh it's off the i can't think of it right now i think it's uh sui like sui pets or i don't know something like that i wish i would have known sorry guys i didn't throw that one down in my notes but i i just remembered it right now as i was thinking about going back to <laughs> playing around on their test net so as far as their platform their ecosystem goes i mean they're 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 definitely up to par with uh, ethereum and solana and internet computer however there's um i think there's a little more um advancement for them to get to um the ethereum and uh solana and maybe the uh internet computer level per se and that's kind of why i put this project at a 20x you know like because i think that they're awesome and i think they'll grow significantly but I do believe that there's still like room to grow, um, but you never know. I mean, the crypto, the crypto market is very, very strange. There's a lot of money that goes into certain projects that we just never hear about. And I believe Sui is one of those that a lot of people don't know about right now. Um, so that's why I'm bringing it to your guys attention. All right. So let's jump into the second part of it. Again, guys, I apologize um, if I'm going back and forth because I did, I did have to capture some notes for this because uh, I wanted to make sure I was as accurate as possible when I'm giving you guys the information. So if you see me turn my head, I'm just keeping it real, guys. You know what I mean? Um, and I'm trying to do this and give you guys what you guys need and give it to you at a very um, genuine uh, way. Okay. So Sui block, uh, blockchain distinguishes itself with a unique set of features that contribute to its appeal and functionality with Web3 ecosystem. So looking at some of the key features that Sui has to offer, um, number one is they have gasless transactions. So Sui simplifies the user experience by enabling gasless transactions. So in this system, decentralized applications uh, settle gas fees on behalf of its users. So eliminating the need for users to manage gas fees directly, this user-friendly approach aims to make blockchain interaction more accessible to a broader audience. Um, the next thing they have is like uh, package upgrades. So <clears throat> upgradability is crucial aspect of any blockchain smart contract system. So Sui essentially handles the elegancy by allowing smart contracts to exist um, as an immutable package. Okay, so this approach enables developers to upgrade contracts seamlessly so they could basically upgrade it without any problems, adding or removing functionalities um, after deployment. So it grants developers, this is geared towards developers, greater control over their contracts, promoting flexibility and adoptability in Web3 landscape. So how do they do this? How does SUI do this? They use this uh, ZK implementation. So, so uh, SUI is forward thinking in its integration of zero knowledge proofs. So there's other projects that I talked about that have uh, zero knowledge proofs in there. Um, I think Mina Protocol uses ZK. Um, there's a couple other projects that use it. But with the forward thinking, um, the architecture protects user privacy through ZK embedded system and an open ID for logins addressing the growing importance of privacy concerns in Web3. Um, so to ensure tamper-proof random numbers or for applications like betting and gaming, SUI incorporates a league of entropy. So this innovation employs a sufficient randomness generation scheme known as 
Drand of Beacon. So it enhances the security and reliability of random number generation and crucial for various use cases. So their dynamic and composable objects, SUI's architecture resolves around objects that are programmable with inherent properties. Objects are directly stored on chain, providing transparency and security. So objects can essentially um, foster composability, um, versatility within the SUI ecosystem. So essentially entering and exiting cryptocurrency project to maximize your profit requires careful planning and consideration. So what we're going to do is talk about some fundamentals because I, in all my videos, I try to give you guys, uh, you know, some sort of investing tip so that you can be a better investor for today, for tomorrow and your future. So we're going to do, um, the basic fundamentals of investing in cryptocurrency. So I'm going to go through a plan on how to teach you guys to be able to know how to pick your projects and go through some of that information to be able to get you to be a, uh, to an understanding where you're investing in a smart manner. Okay. So we're, let's cover this real quick. All right. So I'm going to talk to you on a level of <clears throat> what I would do essentially before getting into any cryptocurrency investment. Um, so if you guys want, uh, you could go ahead and take notes on this. Um, I'm going to actually just kind of cover some of the key points when it comes to investing in cryptocurrency. <clears throat> so first off, what you want to do is understand how to research. So what you want to do is begin thorough researching um, crypto projects that you may be interested in. Understand what type of technology uh, it is, uh, meaning like how's the blockchain built? How does it differ from Bitcoin? How does it differ from Ethereum? How is it similar to Bitcoin or how is it similar to Ethereum? Because essentially what we want is we want to understand that bit, we want to know that Bitcoin operates in a certain manner and so does Ethereum. Ethereum is built in a certain specific way. So when you research, you want to do you want to look at the type of blockchain it has. Like, is that blockchain efficient for many things? Um, it does a blockchain use a lot of energy to process transactions. Um, is it a very lean uh, blockchain? Um, how trustworthy is the blockchain? How secure is the blockchain? Everything revolves around blockchain because that is the technology that cryptocurrency is built upon. Next, you want to go into what type of utilities it has, like what use cases, what type of ecosystem is it creating to bring value to you and other peers around you? Is there value in the project that you're going to be able to get from their ecosystem, from the developers building, what are they building on? What are they focused on building on? That's important. So you want to look at their team. Are they transparent? Are there faces out there on their roadmaps? Are there, are they uh, transparent on X? Cause X is essentially our navigation to the projects. You know, these X is a tool that you can use to do your research. Um, their community support again, back to X. I mean, their the crypto has, I think <laughs> essentially I knew, Elon Musk knew what he was doing when he purchased Twitter, because honestly, I mean, cryptocurrency is like correlated with X because that's where all of our information comes from. Not essentially all of it, but a big chunk of knowing what community, what size the community is, uh, how does the community interact with the cryptocurrency? Um, if they have AMAs, is there a lot of community members getting involved in them? How many members show up to an AMA? These types of things are very important when it comes to researching crypto projects. Number two, invest what you can afford to lose, right? So only invest the money that you know you can afford to lose, whatever you're comfortable with. Um, these markets and cryptocurrency are extremely volatile, so it's a, it's a real risky game to play. But you have to have your knowledge behind it when you're going in to invest because you need to understand how crypto moves, how it operates, how, you know, how it works. So if you don't know a lot about it, don't come into here with money that you're, you, you know, you you're going to lose, uh, you're going to lose it. And, and guess what? You know, now you're out, you're upside down. Only put in what you can afford to lose. If you know that you have about 10 grand, five grand, one grand, 500, 200, that's all you can afford. That's all you can afford. Put that in and work your way up. But that's why we invented the dollar cost average, right? So if you can't be one of those person that lump sums into a crypto project, you know, there's a dollar cost average strategy, <clears throat> you know, this is a strategy where you could actually balance it out, right? So if you could, if you can't afford 
a thousand dollars up front but you could put 500 today and you know pay a hundred every two weeks you know it's only going to take about five weeks or you know ten weeks to get to that extra five hundred dollars to get to your thousand and what that does the dca strategy kind of balances everything out you know so the markets be going like this up and down up and down up and down you could catch it here you could catch it here you could get lucky catch it here catch it here catch it here catch one up here one two you know it depends and what i mean is like you could catch the you know the coin when it's pumping or the coin when it's dumping obviously you want to be at the bottom when you're getting into a, a a cryptocurrency so that's your target you know try to try to hit those bottoms you know and it but it's not good to time the market right so dollar cost averaging allows you to get in stay consistent you know and it's going to balance out you'll balance out by the time it's all said and done so <clears throat> What else you want to do so we'll go key i think it's key number four so you want to set a target so decide on a profit target or exit strategy if you guys have watched my videos you guys know that i plant these exit strategies it's a normally three three where's the camera oh there you are three three exits generally and i put targets at all three of those exit and i allocate percentages to those exits so um you know being successful at that is very hard it's very hard it's not an easy game uh, but you can't be successful at it as long as you keep doing it over and over and over again uh if you learn the watch rinse and repeat method which we'll be talking about that in my patreon so keep on keep an eye out should be coming out launching hopefully if not at the end of this week at the beginning of next week i'll launch my patreon all the links will be in the description so i hope you guys subscribe run my crypto so you guys can take advantage of that patreon because you know we're gonna have nothing but the greatest info when it comes to crypto investing all right so yes those three exit strategies um make sure you guys learn those um you know learn where you know you want to take um what percentages you want to take out of your portfolio in profits at what percentage of uh profit all right so have your exit plan your exit strategy before you invest this could be based on researching uh certain target price time frames percentage gains stick to your plan so generally my plan is to as the market bails out in the next crypto bull run um, I plan to start learning about new cryptos coming out and different projects and preparing for the next bull run after this bull run is over um, so yeah so that's it guys um, just wanted to touch on give you guys some key points um, there's a lot more to this so if you guys jump into the patreon again like I said Keep an eye out on it. Um, we're going to have all this information in there. Um, tons of crypto calls. We're going to have a lot of stuff going on in the Patreon. So hopefully you guys could jump in there. Um, I'll be blasting it on every video that comes out once I get that up and running, guys. So appreciate you guys. Uh, thank you guys who all have liked, who all have subscribed, and all you su supporters. Ugh, so I'm sorry. So all the supporters on my channel, uh, from the bottom of my heart, I really appreciate it. You know, I try to do everything I can to give you guys the best information um, that will help you guys be successful. All right, guys. So, Sui, look out for it. 2024 bull run. I think Sui's going to come out with a 20x, guys. $10 billion market cap. $10 to $15 uh, billion dollar market cap. So, that's where I think Sui's going to go, especially because it's a newer project. But uh, it's a nice, robust system. So, Hope you guys got some value out of this. Make sure you guys hit that like and subscribe button and I'll see you guys on the next one. Take care, be blessed, and as always, stay safe. And remember, this is not financial advice, just crypto education. All right, guys, take care. Have a great night. Be blessed.